this is obviously, obviously to me, obviously, obvious to you, um, a battle of good versus evil. What would you say to people who don't see that? How can you describe this unseen world? Well, you know, years ago, the Lord spoke to my heart. He says, no one's targeting false ideologies with massive fasting and prayer. Daniel's fast shifted principalities and powers over kings that were ruling with false ideologies and a war against Israel. So when Haman brought his decree of death, it was literally the day before Passover. They would have been reading the Passover story the next day and realizing there's a death decree over our whole nation we must understand that there is there a Passover for, for Israel, the Jews at that time? Is there a Passover for America? That's the question I've been asking. So when Esther fasts for three days, she's dealing in the spirit realm because Haman was actually uh, delving into divination and demonic powers. She understood that you can't challenge the ideologies that are fueled by witchcraft and demonization, you can't unless you deal with it in the spiritual realm.